What is up, guys? Uh, two days uh, until rifle hunting. Um, so super, super excited for that. Uh, Brian and I will be going up. Uh, Ian's maybe, he hasn't let us know yet. Um, so uh, usually, uh, for all our hunting trips, we always bring some snackies, some delicious drinks. Uh, and I think I'm going to switch it up a little bit this year, and I thought I'd uh, clue you in and let me uh, show you the process. Uh, you can probably see it in the corner of the screen here, uh, but I'm going to bring up a couple blocks of smoked cheese, um, which is definitely a delicacy that me, Ian, and Brian love to partake in. Uh, it's easy to do. And it's absolutely delicious, uh, whether you're eating it by itself or on a cracker or uh, putting it on a uh, charcuterie board. It's awesome. So I got a bunch of blocks that we're going to be doing today. Uh, I usually smoke. Uh, obviously, it's a cold smoke. You don't want to melt the cheese, obviously. Um, I usually smoke them for about mm, four, four to six hours. Typical times around four and it's still really great. I haven't really noticed much of a difference, um, between, you know, going more than four hours. Uh, but we got some marble jack, drop it there, marble cheddar, sharp cheddar, pepper jack, different versions of pepper jack, mild cheddar, you name it, basically I got it. So, got about three, six, nine, twelve, uh, fifteen blocks of cheese here, so I am going to prep and get these ready and get the tube going. Uh, I'll show you guys how to do that. Uh, so stay tuned. Just give me a couple minutes and we will get that all set and ready for you. And I'll walk you through it. All right, guys, now we're out in the garage. Uh, got the smoker. I'll show you that all uh, in just a minute here. Uh, it's all set, ready to go. Super easy to do this. Uh, I got a Kingsford uh, tube. Uh, you can tell it's gotten some use out of it. But super simple, guys. Uh, we'll be using uh, just the Hip Boss Competition Blend of pellets. And it's as simple as this. Just really take the tube and you're filling it. You're literally filling it up. Um, I'll open up the bag a little bit. Ah. Get in there with the tube. There we go. And just scoop it in. Super easy. Alright, and you don't want to fill it up all the way, maybe about three quarters. Um because you want to leave a little bit of room because you're gonna you're gonna set it down uh horizontally and you don't want you know any of the uh pellets to fall out or whatever. Um, my biggest challenge when I got this was, um, how do I get this lit and stay lit? Uh, matches didn't work. One of those, you know, just one of those regular household lighters didn't work. Uh, so I ended up actually getting just a, uh, a propane blowtorch, which has worked amazingly. Um, so... Uh, I will bring this over to the grill and I will show you that uh, next. All right, tube, propane heater, or blowtorch, not heater. Something else in my mind there. All right, just gonna turn it on and pull the trigger. And we're just just hitting the pellets till it gets going. All 
away. You can see how it's smoking. We're cooking that. Alright. See? Now I'll show you this in just a second here. Uh, actually, I might hit it a little bit more. There we go. There we go. Perfect. Wrong way. There we go. All right. So take, let's take a look here. All right. Perfect. See, that's what we want. Uh, maybe not the flame, but that'll that'll go down with time here. Um, yes. Yeah, so obviously, one of the biggest things that you need to worry about while doing this. Uh, is having the tube so close to the cheese that it does start to melt. Learned that the hard way once. But uh but yeah, if you can avoid that you'll be you'll be golden. Um because obviously you're you're closing the actual grill here so the smoke stays in there. Um so let me throw the cheese on and we'll give you a little update with that. Alright y'all cheese is now on uh, I like to do it this way I uh, have the tube exactly where it's at uh, uh, hopefully that flame disappears but I still got my cheese far enough away to where I'm not too worried about it melting uh, I like to keep a little bit of space in between each block as you can see just so the smoke can circulate through and around each block of cheese so and I'll come out and rotate them like every, I don't know, 45 minutes to an hour. You know, flip them around or, you know, move this one over a little bit and then this one over here. You know, just rotate them. Just so they each get, uh, you know, a different range of smoke. Um, so, like I said, we'll uh, let this go for about... Four, four to six hours. I think today will probably be four and a half, five, because uh, I am planning on smoking something else for dinner tonight. I think. Uh, but we will uh, check in on a little bit uh, when it's time to rotate them. All right, guys. Time to do a little rotating of the cheese. Oh yeah, look at that. Good smoke, man. I wish y'all could smell this. It smells amazing. Oh, 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 look at that. <laughs> Looking good. <coughs> <coughs> All right. Move it down. See, flame's finally gone. So that is good. Move you there. Let's just uh, do this here. All right. Perfect. God, this smells amazing. Uh, here we go. And, all right. Let's see, yep, it's burning real good. Perfect. See, you guys, it's literally that simple. Um, and I am so excited. Uh, it's been a while since I've had some, some good old smoked cheese, so I'm super excited to have some. Oh, there are the dogs. <laughs> All right, stay tuned, guys. All right, guys, let's check it out. Looks like there's no more smoke coming, so it should be... Ooh, yep, she is done. Ooh. A little warm. <laughs> Man, this looks perfect. Oh, man. Oh, all right. Yeah, let's take it off. Oh, God, yes. This is perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. 
Yeah, you, you know what's done when you feel like a little bit of grease on there. I don't know if you can see that, but oh god, yes. <laughs> perfect. Just perfect. Alright. Gosh, just amazing. So excited to have some of this. Alright, perfect. Alright, well I'm going to bring it in and uh, we'll do the taste test. Alright guys, moment of truth. I grabbed my favorite flavor, uh, cheddar. So let's, uh, let's, give it a, let's give it a go. Just a small, small piece. Man, that is good. Man, you can definitely take the taste the smoky flavor. Love it. But uh, here, it's just a show of difference here. So here's the inside. See, I don't know if you guys can really see that, but it's lighter than it is on the on the outside. And that just goes to show that. He absorbed the smoke really well. Uh, I'm gonna be smoking more more cheese later on in this winter, uh, and I'll definitely probably do a longer smoke. But this is a perfect amount of time for what it is, and I'm just gonna cut off this. Ah, I'm just gonna have another piece. Why not? But uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, keep your eyes open for Brian is so kindly editing. Uh, our duck hunting video uh, which are short from that trip it's almost at 30,000 views right now so thank you guys uh, so definitely keep your eyes open there'll be more videos coming up really soon all right we'll check in with you guys later